Hi there, students. Iridescence or opalescence. Both of these are nouns. I think iridescent with a T or opalescent with a T, the adjective. And then certainly as a verb to opalesque. Okay, so if something is iridescent, it shines with the colours of a rainbow. You've seen a soap bubble. The sun shines on the soap bubble and you see blues and pinks and purples. Yeah, this is showing the different colours of the rainbow. So if something is iridescent, it's shining with the, the colours of a rainbow. It's got bright colours that are changing with movement. So the, um, I caught a fish and the iridescence of the fish skin was quite beautiful. Um, there was uh, oil on the water and the oil looked iridescent. Now opalescent is exactly the same except with a slight milky white colour. <laughs> so normally if something is iridescent it's clear whereas if it's opalescent the, the surface is slightly milky like an opal. Um, so, iridescent, shining, shining with colours. Um, yeah, it's a rainbow-like um, colours that come from something from the refraction of light. Yeah, um, things that are, are, have iridescence are, can be very beautiful. Maybe you find a piece of glass that's been buried for many years and you will see it uh, opalesce if it's white or iridesce if it's clear, yeah? Okay, so this is, this, this is just the physics of light, yeah? I guess um, these flies, these blue bottle flies are iridescent. Okay, so iridescent and then opalescent, exactly the same, but r like an opal. So the scales of the fish could be iridescent or opalescent, or even both. Yeah, I think it's probably uh, a matter of opinion. So opalescent, reflecting iridescent light. Uh, exhibiting a milky iridescence like that of an opal yeah um an opalescent uh, blue piece of blue glass yeah so he's got a, this one's going to have a milky blue color but with shine with shiny rainbow colors suddenly appearance suddenly appearing okay so uh, the piece of glass opalesced in the sun yeah its iridescence was quite beautiful. Um, the uh, dress uh, was a very thin iridescent material that shone different colours of the rainbow depending on the angle. If something's iridescent, the colours are moving. Yeah, they're normal or and opalescent as well. They're not exact. Then they're they're not static. They change according to the angle of the light. Yeah. Um, so yes, I could see an opalescence in his eyes. Yeah. So they were maybe slightly milky, but they shone with different colours. Yeah. So effectively, um, shining iridescent rainbow light. Okay, so how formal are both of these words? Iridescent and opalescent. I would probably give these words a 6, 6.5 in formality. You could use these words in an informal conversation, <laughs> but they do sound very literary and quite posh. 
these are good for a dis good words for a descriptive e essay. I think I would uh, use shining rainbow colours or yeah, giving shining with the colours of the rainbow, something like that. Yeah, and then the origin, well, opalescent from the word an opal, which is a precious stone. Um, uh, and then opalescent s the for the um, the power of or the property of that's a much better word I was looking for yeah and then iridescence I'm not sure about the the origin of the irid bit but uh, I'm sure somebody somebody be able to tell me that. Okay, so these are good use words to use in exam essays. They're not going to be people's first choice or native speakers' first choice, but they sound quite good and they sound quite different. So, opalescence, the noun, opalescent, the adjective, opalesce, the verb, iridescence, iridescent, and I guess iridesce as well. So, if you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now. Iridescence, opalescence.